<clears throat> I'm kind of pissed, bro. I freaking recorded this already, and then I realized that Firefox sucks. So we're going to have to use Google Chrome on this one. So what's this video about? Well, I watched a pretty sick anime recently. I don't know why it was so recent, but I did. Called Kenichi, the Mightiest Disciple. And you might think, oh, wow, this looks like a really weeb anime. And this guy talks about weeb animes all the time. So he must be watching a weeb anime. And no, I don't watch what you people watch. I actually don't watch TV or anything. But I did watch this at my friend's house. And I thought it was pretty cool. So why should you watch this? Um, I don't know, actually. <laughs> that's, a good, that's a good fucking question, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it. I had a whole video. I had a whole 30 minute video of why you should watch this shit. And all the points and all the character introductions. But now I'm looking at it and I'm just like, I I don't even want to anymore. I don't even want to say why to watch it. I don't think there are much words to say at this point. Yeah. Sorry, I did make another video about this, but um Firefox works in a way where if you're recording what Firefox is doing, then you don't see it. You just see a black screen. Look at that artwork. It's crazy too. This guy's like old. He's like 50 something and she's like 16. But. Okay, anyway. Anime be weird. Anime is just weird. Like, I don't know what to say about anime, to be honest. The story is pretty dumb, though. I was talking about the story with the first fist. Let me see if it says his name here. Mm. Odin? That's the boxer's name? Okay, cool. Nijima! Oh, I guess I started with Nijima. Look how the screen just went black. Oh, it's fucking cool. Nijima's my favorite character. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. If anybody's bad talking Nijima, they suck. Straight up. Look at this guy. The Nijima eye. Ooh. Does it work? Is it real? Let's see. Let's see what the Weibo internet has to say about Nijima eye. Signature techniques, stares at his opponent and gathers information by scanning them, creates a mental dialogue. That's not how you spell observation, you fucking retards. Bro, how do these people, like, run internet sites and shit? Intuition. It almost looks like intuition is spelled wrong too, doesn't it? 
Intuition. Is this supposed to be a T? Wait a minute. These fucking idiots, bro. They can't spell for shit, yo. Fandom. Ugh. You see, once a person has, like, grammar slash spelling mistakes, I don't take whatever... I don't take anything they say seriously after that. Not a single fucking thing. If you can't spell the words that you're saying then why the fuck should I listen to them? You know what I mean? So, yeah. Get good, internet. Get fucking good. Because most of your shit is not worth paying any attention to. Is this a real game? They actually have a game? Oh, yeah, look at that. I guess there is a game. That's interesting. Look at Siegfried in the game. <laughs> it's funny. Six Siegfried is the sixth fist, I think. And he's the opera singer. All he does is sing his lines. I thought he was kind of stupid until after I realized he was the most trustworthy motherfucker on the crew. <clears throat> well, you know, Nijima's pretty trustworthy too. Look how badass this guy is. Ah, look at him. He always, he always like sets you up to think for you to think that, oh, he's going to fight you. But then guess what? He runs away and he leads you to a trap. Look at these psycho, psycho people, bro. Like, I get it, you're trying to do a f cosplay or whatever. But you could at least get the teeth and the horns too, fool. Because he, he does have the teeth and the fucking horns. Look, you want to see? You think I'm lying? He has teeth and horns, bro. And the, and the tongue. Bro, get the tongue right too, bro. He has horns. He has like an antenna or some shit on his head. Uh, Nijima. And then, what is it? Like horns? Horns or it's like a antenna. What did I say? I didn't say tentacle, did I? Was I just thinking it? Please tell me I was just thinking that. Uh, let's see. Well, it's not showing it. The man has horns, bro. I'm telling you, he has horns. Okay, well, whatever, internet. All I know is the man has horns. He has them. This internet might not show you that shit, but he does have horns. Look, see? Or antenna. Two of them. Oh, a horn and an antenna. Look at that. That's the cosplay right there. See the tongue? See the antennas? The horn? I know it's just a drawing, but this guy drew it properly. He did it good. This is what a cosplay should look like with the shoes and everything, you know. See those shoes? Wabaki. Wabaki. <clears throat> right? See? He has the horns. Or antennas or whatever. Hmm. Oh, this girl has a thing where you can't, like, approach her from the back or she kicks your ass. Like, it's a subli- Oh, what the hell? Is this a thing that happens? Did I see this episode? <laughs> Did 
Did they? Okay, I guess she does get hit a little bit, but I, I guess I guess I didn't really have time to look at that episode. Wow, did that, does this actually happen for real? And they detailed it and everything? Can I see like an actual high definition picture of that? Oh, I thought that was, okay, okay. I thought that was something else. Hmm. Okay, so this girl is the Chinese master's daughter. Obviously, she's wearing a Chinese outfit. Like Chun-Li. She even has a freaking... Wait a minute. You have bells on your head? And you jump around like a ninja? What the fuck are you doing? Those snitch you out the most. And even if you're not trying to be snitched out and you have like the most reflexive movements... Where it's like, you know that your movements are not making the bells go off. You're still going to be in a situation where you don't want those bells to go off. And they're going to go off. What the fuck? Oh, that's another thing about the animes that are on nowadays. Look, she looks like a man. See that face? Look at this. And this better freaking show up, eh? If this is a black screen, I'm just going to post a freaking black screen. So, wait, what am I doing? Cutting over her whole body. Look, isn't that a, isn't that a male face right there? Wouldn't you call that a male face? Thick eyebrows. Angry stare. Bruh. What am I looking at here? Uh, might as well put Kenichi in some big tits. Why not? What's this? Wasn't this? What the fuck? Let me see this thing for a sec. Is this from the manga? Apachai. Apachai. That's his name. Up a chai. What is this? Okay, so. Up a chai's training. So this is in the manga. Okay, so Nijima ear. Strongest weapon. Yeah, cool. That's actually really cool. Weird ass sensor. This sensor is the secret to his survival. Incidentally, as you can see here. It's in super sensitive mode right now. Ah, ha, ha, his sensor is super sensitive mode. That's funny. Nijima eyes. See right through to someone else's weakness. Hey, that's fucking sick. Yo, they should have had an RPG of this game, bro. Harry, of course. 50cc. <laughs> 50cc. It's funny. Nijima pouch. Not found on human beings. A special organ possessed only by Nijima. Harry. Why does everything have to be here? Harry. Hmm. One day with these two hands, I will rule the world. Only shows its true powers when running away. It has been said that Carl Lewis had come up with his running style after watching Nijima run away. <laughs> bro, yo, Nijima's sick, bro. You don't, you don't even know about Nijima. Strength. Student ranking. A, that's smart. Right? So Nijima, to me, is like the main character of the show. I don't care what anybody says. They can be like, oh, Kenichi's training, oh, Apachai uh, being so cool and uh, being, uh... yeah, but, you know, the story wouldn't be the story without Nijima. And this little shit right here, ugh, this little shit.
Um, uh, there. Point right at his. Point right into his eye. Right in the eye. But then it looks like I'm pointing at the boxer guy. There we go. Mm, maybe I could point at him too. <laughs> okay, so this is the manga, huh? And it's in English. Ooh. Oh, this is one of the first episodes when freaking the boxer was trying to beat up Kenichi. Nah, that's Nijima. Nijima's sick, bro. Nijima's smart. The Shinpaku Alliance. What a cool name. Fucking opera chai. Look at this girl, bro. Backflip, jump, stomp on this guy's hand. Ah, kick him in the face too. Damn, Nijima, for real. <laughs> See, look at this right here, what he said. Oh, Nijima, you never get the respect that you deserve. <laughs> Look at this. Oh. Oh, them shots? Oh, anime. You never change, do you? Oh, we have a strict policy. Oh, can't put... Um, what is it? What is the policy? There's like, oh, you can't put like... Pubic hair, right? You can't put pubic hair in any, of, any more animations and blah, blah, blah. It's illegal or some shit like that. But you could still have girls in super mini skirts freaking upskirting them all the time, even in cartoons, for real. Like, can they can they wear the mini skirt and us just be like top view, looking at them go out the door? <laughs> or like even back view would kind of, I don't know, front view or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> Playing rock paper scissors. I want to play Seuss. I want to say Seuss MC, but I don't know. I don't know where we even thought of that name from. Seuss MC. And then those foot tag games. Ugh, I don't even want to think of those right now. It's Upachai turn. Oh, man. Upachai, stop kicking my ass, please. D 
deeper than the mountain, higher than the ocean. <laughs> oh, that's it? That's the end of the story? Okay. This guy is the thrower. I'm the thrower. I will throw you. And then... And then, you know what's fucked up? See this kid right here? Sorry about the um, audio or whatever. But see this kid right here? This guy almost jump kick breaks this guy's arm, bro. I fucking hate this kid so bad, bro. This man, like, if he... If Kenichi didn't show up, this guy would have had his arm super fucking broken. Right. There's a lot of fight scenes in the in the show. That's why I'm thinking this. That should be a thing that I should say. In the beginning, actually. But you know, I didn't really know what to say in the beginning of this video, and hopefully this video even fucking works. So you know what? I'm just gonna say, or suggest that. Y'all check out this show. It's called Kenichi, the Mightiest Disciple. And I'm not going to say that it's my favorite show. But it does have its moments out. I don't know why that fucking always happens. Right? It always... I mean, it has its moments. Sorry. Ugh. Man, something in my neck just snapped. I think I'm going to die in like 20 seconds. So I'm going to end the video before I die and have to go get rushed to the hospital. But just check it out. This guy's name is Hermit, by the way. And he's the most badass motherfucker on the show. Ugh, I've died.